once again, this is Markamel16 with another Assassin's Creed 3 Let's Play when we left off. I just, uh... I just, uh, I'm sorry. I kinda just attacked a boat. Uh, and, uh, like a boss. Ow, oh, screw this. I'm gonna run. I'm just gonna sprint it. You guys have nothing on me. Oh, in the trees! Let's get my tree running on. If you know it. Oh no. Oh no. Look how many people are over there. Oh my gosh. That is a lot of people, you might say. Christ. That's crazy. Mmm, that's just so many people. I am just so mad about it. Okay. That's a lot of people. <laughs> if I didn't say that enough, I'd love to just try and beat him as Ezio because Ezio could actually attempt it. He's awesome. Well, with the controls of Ezio. Oh. That was pretty amazing. What am I doing? Oh, am I killing him? Nice. Oh, hey! Hey! Soldier! Oh, good! Good! Uh oh. Um. Not the best situation to be in. <laughs> John, better die. Oh, I'm screwed. I'm screwed, I suck. I suck. How's that slice on your face? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no. Alright. Kill him. Kill him. No, oh, I didn't get you in time. Dang it. I want a double thing. This is so awesome. No, no thanks. That's him. Human shield. Human shield. Human shield. Human shield. That's the first time I think I've ever done that. Is that regular kill? Oh. Huh? <laughs> what was that? Nope! Oh, thanks. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Man, John sucks. He's so cocky looking. He's like, nah. Dang it, stop it. Oh no. He's getting attacked. Oh! You got nothing. <sighs> Regulars are doing more than you are. Nope. Oh no. Human shield. Human shield. Human shield. Somebody. Somebody come up. This is a intense battle. No thanks. Mm -mm. Not having this today. Oh, block. What you got? What you got? Oh no. Oh no. Oh jeez. Oh that just took off so much life. Oh. Okay. <gasps> Gosh, this is a really intense fight. Wish I didn't trigger this fight. This is really bad. I figured I'd just assassinate him one shot if I was any good at this game. Die. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is the right re are regulars like good people? Is that why I can't kill them? Because they're like supposed to be innocent. They just happen to be. That's what I'm gonna guess. Back the truck off, pal. Oh no, you just got blocked. Oh, slicing it, slicing your health away. It's kind of playing in your guts there with my sword. That was gross. No, no, I can't die yet. I'm too young. Oh, oh, you're on your own, John. You're on your own. Who's gonna protect you now? Who's gonna do all the work for you now? You got nobody. You're dead. 
Mm. Mm. Oh, it just doesn't feel good at all, does it? Oh no. Kill him. What is stopping you? Oh. Oh man. He's just dying. He's not having a good day at all. <laughs> Get back up. You worthless. No. Okay, I thought I failed. Oh man. Oh no. Oh. He dead. That was too long. Jeez. Only thing good about you is you can take a hit. 50 slices to the face. He is really cut up. Why? Why did you do this? To protect Adam and Hancock and those they serve. You meant to kill them. Kill them? Are you mad? I wanted only to parley. There was so <laughs> much to discuss. To explain. If you put an end to that now. If you speak true, then I will carry your last words to them. They must lay down their arms. They must stop this war. Why them and not the Redcoats? Do you not know think we ask the same question of the British? These things take time. And I would have succeeded had you let me play my part. Part of the puppeteer. For better we hold the strings on another. No, the strings should be severed. All should be free. Get on. But we should live forever on castles in the sky. You wield your blade like a man, but your mouth like a child. <laughs> and more will die now because of that. Man. It is better to have faith as well. None at all. Give me that. Uh oh. This ain't gonna be good. <laughs> Get out of there. Run, son. No one is better. Oh, let's see what you gotta say, guy. How dare you sneak up on me like that? Why don't you just go off there and just help this chap retreat? Don't ever do that again, you hear me? God damn it! <sighs> Calm down. General Putnam. You live. The, the same cannot be said for Pitcairn. <laughs> well done, I suppose. <laughs> but it matters little now. I'm ordering a full retreat. We have lost too many in exchange for too little. If the Tories want this hill so badly, let them have it. Boston is the full prize. We have a bigger problem. What do you mean? Have Another letter. Oh. Oh, just great. Oh, this fantastic. This can't be right. It says they plan to murder Washington. Not Washington! Don't get me out. Don't get me out of the animus. I don't wanna. Oh no, I feel the worst. I feel the worst is upon me, guys. I feel the animus sinking into darkness. Desmond is appearing. I don't even know. I just don't want to play Desmond. I mean, yeah, Desmond. I kind of do want to play Desmond. What am I talking about? My Desmond is tenacious. Oh, no. When money failed okay. them, they I don't took care the force. Way but I have slain Johnson and Pitcairn both, ending their plots. George Washington now rallies the colonists, and their march towards freedom begins in earnest. Little earnest. wonder, then, that the Templars now want him dead. They seek to reshape this land into something cold and ordered, something soulless. And he is an obstacle. I must save him, that his cause can flourish and my people remain safe. But the more I prod, the greater the chance I am discovered. The Templars believe their men lost the revolution. In their eyes, the assassins are gone and scattered, no longer a threat. Scattered. <laughs> but I fear they will soon discover the truth, and me along with it. I must tread carefully. I must tread carefully. Oh, snap. How fast is the hunt, Connor? 
There is progress, but I worry I it's not enough. You must strike where you need it most. What if you pursued Charles Lee and your father? What then of Paul Revere and the soldiers at Lexington? Soldiers? There were no soldiers in those towns, only men and women who were forced to defend themselves. Is this not why you fight? To protect your people? Your struggle is the colonist's struggle. In helping one, you help the other. Dang you. Who's that guy over there? Hickory. Encouraging words from one who thought mine a fool's errand. <laughs> Make no mistake, I still do, but I can't help but feel some pride in your success. And why should I give you any credit? <laughs> You're then don't. a jerk. But uh, first, return the robe and the blade, the blade. And, the, and the darts and all of the years of training and knowledge I have bestowed upon <laughs> you. Return these and... Then your words may have some merit. He's like a child. Or you could just admit that you are wrong. Oh, child, please, you've killed two men. One more salesman than soldier. You're gonna have to try a lot harder than that to impress me. Is that so, old man? Or Gosh. perhaps we should step outside. I will gladly demonstrate how easily I could... Trunks. Connor, no, this is man. Benjamin Talmadge. His he father was one of like us, no need for secrecy. I think he has something he wants to say. Achilles tells me you've uncovered a plot to murder the Commander-in-Chief. Yes, Jeez, but I have Connor only false smart. starts and dead ends to show for it. Not anymore, my friend. Thomas Hickory. Hey, Hickory, I just saw him on the board. Thomas Hickey's your man, and oh, I aim to Hickey. help you catch him. I don't know why I got that How? Awesome. I'll explain on the oh, way. Explain on the way. You and I are going to New, New York. York. Oh yay! I'm so excited. <sighs> oh man, I just can't wait to go to New York. Oh yes. All right. Well, click the annotation in the top right corner of the video if you want to see the next one. Um, I'm mainly saying that because this one's over. Yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> But, um, yeah, so I guess...